we just ran out of battery, so we're gonna put this in our pocket. We're gonna take off our cooling system for our, I'm actually gonna put this on my wrist. We're gonna take off our cooling system for our camera, cause you don't need it out here. And I, like I was just telling you, I have green slime in these tires. So if there's a hole, the slime is gonna come out. If it's a little tiny pinhole, which more often than not, that's the type of flat you get, that green slime is gonna cover my ass. And if, if, if it's a bigger pinhole and the tire goes all, all the way down, it, this green slime will, will not allow the green slime will not allow it'll keep three four pounds pressure in the tire depending on how bad it is that's kind of a nice little fucking thing huh guys Phone mount looks good. Everything looks good. It's not sliding. These little rubber gussets here that I bought, they're kind of thin and cheap. If you tried to stretch one around all four corners of this big phone, you would have issues. But if you use two of them and stretch it around, it's a pretty good little, it works out pretty good. It's holding the phone pretty nice. So. Oh man, my head can breathe. It was getting a little hot around the, the head air, area there with those chokes on. But when I left, it was cold, bro. The clouds were, the clouds were uh, making it cold. So uh, I felt some issues coming with my ears and I nipped it in the bud right away. Let's take a look at this phone mount here. It's not sliding up or down, and it's not, the phone's not coming out. So, I'm a happy camper when I see that. And we did some serious, serious uh, technical riding here and on that other trail. Boulder hiding in the grass, grass there. You gotta keep your pedals. Keep your, there's another one. You gotta pay attention, man. Oh man, that's beautiful. Whoops, whoops, off trail. I was checking to make sure my jacket was affixed to my backpack, and it is. Oh shit, my fucking foot. <laughs> my foot hit that fucking clump of grass. You see what I mean? You gotta pay attention. You know, just when you think you've got this shit down, look out, man. Shit can pop up quicker than you can say. Wahoo! I'm gonna pass you right there on the left. You're all right, you okay? I don't wanna scare you. you. You have a good day, okay?
I doubt if I got any coverage in this draw here, drainage. But man, I sure would like to. I think we'll be able to. I, it's just a question of me hearing that phone go. I get a uh, shotgun blast when a message comes in. I'd like to be able to hear that when you do stop. And. Oh, oh man. Rock. High rock on both sides of the trail there. Chipmunk. <sighs> I was getting ready to hit this fucking thing. Looking ahead and I went up, my front tire went off trail there. No harm, no foul. But, shit can happen in a quick hurry, guys. My front tire went off trail there and lost Lost my edge. Good thing it was a fat tire bike. If it was a skinny tire bike. Skinny tire bike, I might have been on my face. I might have did a face plant there. Man, it, does that dog shit a lot or... That lady looks like she's having a lot of fun. I enjoy that, seeing that too. Oh, there's plenty of water in the creek down there. Focus on the trail, not focus on the trail, not on the fall to the right. Oh man, beautiful day. Huh? It's amazing. This is uh, typically, you can do this stuff well into your stay in reasonable shape. And you can do this stuff well into your, and don't break your leg or hip or anything. <laughs> you can do this stuff well into your 80s. We still got the Walther. Gonna double check, make sure I still got it. I've got the uh, belly holster on today. Much more comfortable, and, it, and the temperature is it's, permits it to wear it. Hmm, running into a lot of bugs. Come on, squirrel. <laughs> it's just chipmunk. Sitting right there on the trail. <laughs> I, I don't want to ruin any little chipmunk's day, man. I break for chipmunk. There's another one. There must be something fucking... There must be something in, the, in that soil that... Maybe they're digging for bugs or worms or some, something. You know what I'm saying? 
buried in the in the sand crickets whatever it is i don't know what they fucking eat maybe it's some type of seed shoot that's coming up they can smell it but they sit right there on the trail right up to the last minute whoa Focus, gentlemen, focus. Hocus, focus, hocus, focus. Boy, it, it is very nice temperature. E even in the sun, oh my God, it's nice. Cool. When you're moving. It looks like we have one or two green bars left. We, highly unlikely, we're gonna make it back. The way back is all uphill, but we'll stretch this baby out. I'm curious to see how far I can stretch a battery. Now that we're out of the technical trail, we're going to raise our seat back up so that when we pedal, our leg is almost fully extended. That's the way you want it. And look at this. I just happened to catch a nice little shade spot where I can readjust my seat back to the height where your legs will stay comfortable, which is about right there. Oh yeah. I should have my melt bike pants on too. These pants will be done today. I can't wait to get those hunting pants. I've been thinking about getting them for a while. They're just made so well for hunting. Knife, they got knife pockets on them, fucking all kinds of good shit. We went up about halfway on this beast. I can live with that. Paying attention here, we don't want to catch a rock hidden in the grass or this trail, the center of this trail is a little low compared to the grass tufts on side of it. Check out this nice little body of water. That might be. Let's take a look at this. Is this a, oh yeah, there is a beaver dam, beaver cottage. This is a, this is a beaver dam here. You got a beaver cottage right there. I mean, it looks like one. A bunch of sticks. That's what the beavers did. They packed this fucker up. These, these beaver, they, uh, I think they eat this bark on these pop, on these, uh, whatever kind of trees those are. Oh. There we go.